construction worker dies after falling at a construction site. CBS 46's Yasmina Austin live near I-285 and Georgia 400. Yasmina, this is not the first time this has happened in that area. Mike, it's not. This is the second time a construction worker died after an incident at the 285-400 interchange project. That first one happened back in October, and then last night a construction worker fell at the same site. These pictures show the rescue efforts after a construction worker fell while working at the 285-400 interchange project Friday night. Emergency crews were able to get him up and take him to the hospital where he later died. They happen quickly all of the time. Alton Matthews is a site safety manager in Metro Atlanta. He does not work at this particular site, but tells us about how quickly an accident can happen. Whenever we're looking at the houses, we always want to look at being proactive versus reactive. In this incident, the worker was an employee for North Perimeter Contractors. They are currently investigating. While we don't know the particulars of what happened, Matthew says it can be common for things to unexpectedly go wrong. Every time I go on a construction site, I think about um, the different, the different uh, possibilities of an accident can happen. And GDOT said they can't provide details right now, but they are working with the developer to learn more. We'll, of course, keep you updated as we learn more about the investigation. Live in Sandy Springs, Yasmina Alston, CBS 46 